Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for joining us today here at Two Wheel Thunder TV. Uh, we're with Rick Fairless at the Dealers Expo in Indianapolis, Indiana. Brother, it's good to see you again. Good to see you again. How you been? We're good. I understand you got some new things happening in the shop. What's going on? Well, we're just building some new bikes, and we're trying to, you know, through this trying economy, we're just trying to, to stay the steady course. You know, I don't want to to cut back so far that you're losing employees. You know, you got to keep your good employees because I have the best employees in the industry. So you keep everybody busy and you keep building bikes and you keep selling parts and you just keep trying to spread the good stroker's word, you know? You know, we're doing a, we're doing a TV show now called Ma's Roadhouse. And uh, we just finished the first season and hopefully we're fixing to start the second season. And it's been good for business and it's brought in a lot of of uh, people that aren't necessarily motorcycle enthusiasts, but those people still wear t-shirts oh, and wear sure. baseball caps and eat cheeseburgers and drink beer, so. That's right. Well, and they gotta have a shirt like yours. That's right. They've gotta have a stroker shirt. I mean, everybody, you go to different places, we cover events from Miami to LA, and we walk around and we see somebody, we show, well, I know where he's been. That's right, <laughs> so. a lot of, of tie-dye shirts. Yeah, and, the, and it stands out, but it's good though. Yeah. It tells me that people are stopping at strokers. Yes, sir. And we like that. You know, ladies and gentlemen, one of the things that uh, that we've all learned about uh, Rick over the years is his love for the business, his passion for the business. But every day what I admire, uh, or a lot of things I admire about Rick, uh, but every day, it doesn't make any difference if the Pope is in town. But from 11 to 12, he goes to lunch with his wife. Now he's there from, you open that place up in the morning and you shut it down every evening. Yeah. But every day, that's his time, and uh, that's important. Well, my wife works Monday through Friday, so every Monday through Friday at 11, we go to lunch, and it doesn't matter what's going on. Mm -hmm. At 11 o'clock, I leave, and I take my wife to lunch. Well, and I think that's good. I tell people that all the time, and they think, well, that's really cool. Well, it is. Ladies and gentlemen, this man works all the time. If you go to the shop, he's there all the time. I mean, you, you, literally, you're there all the time. Well, you know, I'm just, it's, to me, it's not really like working, you know? I mean, it's, it's fooling around with motorcycles and talking motorcycles all day, every day to people, and it's just what I love to do. And I, I love meeting people, I love talking to people, and I love, you know, just getting to know people. So it's, uh, it's not really like working, Jimmy, it's just like hanging out with your buddies. Well. I can appreciate that. It's, it's always a, a good time to hang out with you. You've got a great shop. Ladies and gentlemen, if you're ever in the greater Dallas uh, metro area, stop by Strokers. We're going to put their hot link on this video clip. Hopefully it'll be a hot link going yeah. straight to there. Our techies get it right. If not, just copy it and paste it into your browser. It'll take you directly there. There you can find all the cool bikes that he's got, all the cool gear, t-shirts, all the riding apparel that he's got. And then just stop by the shop time, sometime. He'll always take time to see you. If he's not going to lunch with his wife, and if there's not something, if you're not painting something. I'm there. He's there and he'll take time to see you. You know, the other thing I'd like to tell the, the viewers about is uh, we do a radio show on my website. It's called the Rick and Joe T Dumbass Club. <laughs> Spelled D-U-M-A-S-S, -S, which is not the right way to spell it, so that's <laughs> the way we spell it. And if you go to my uh, website, strokersdallas.com, and you click on the about, It'll have a list of stuff, and one of them says Dumbass Club. It's a radio show that we do every week, and it's podcast. So every one of the shows are on there, and we talk about the motorcycle industry and the inner workings of the motorcycle industry. But we also talk about playing golf or Pam Anderson or, or <laughs> you know, anything that boys talk about, we talk about. And it's, it's not politically correct. So be warned, it is not a politically correct. Sometimes we cuss on there, and sometimes my fat friend even uses the F word. Uh-oh. So be careful, but it's a fun show. Check it out. Well, there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Check it out. Go to strokers.com and check them out. Strokersdallas.com. Strokersdallas.com. We're going to put that link down there. Go there and check them out. Go by and see Rick and, and the family. I understand his daughter's getting into the business now. She's in it. She, uh, you've got a great asset there. She's going to be learning and taking things over. But it's a wonderful thing to have some people continue that business and continue the image that they got going there, the quality of work. 
Brother, it's always great hanging out hey, with good you. Good seeing you again. I'll see you in Dallas in a couple of weeks. I'll be there. Okay. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for joining us today.